Guys, I have something special for you today. Sometimes I like to surprise people. And just so you know, welcome back to MTD CNC North America. I'm with my buddy Matt. However, Matt had no idea he was gonna be on camera. He has no idea what I'm gonna ask him. So I wanted to do this so you guys would see just how completely raw and authentic some of this information is unscripted and ready to go. I think Matt's about to punch me in the head or walk off camera. I'm not sure because he was not ready, but this is going to be fun. It's really a simple question. I know that you are extremely proficient at KCS and running all the machines, but what I want to ask you is, what do you love about this Matt Sir when it was brought in from 2019 till now? How has it helped you? Uh, well, it helped me get the job. <laughs> End of conversation. We're done, guys. <laughs> so what else? What, what else? Uh, when uh, when Kyle bought it, he had uh, he had just hired me, so it was actually a couple months before the machine was delivered and installed. So I got to see that whole process. Got to be part of digging the floor for it and all that. And uh, and then yeah, I got to see the first couple things made on it. Did all the all the training with it. So you know, I really like that. But it's it's really not like any machine that I've run before. You know, and I had worked at some pretty big places. Immediately, were there some things that you saw in this machine where you're like, I couldn't do that before, or I didn't know I could do that? You know, that's kind of a statement that some of us make. What did you learn about it? Precision? Well, it's the first machine that I'd run that had any kind of a, a pallet pool on it. And so that was that was a new experience. But, you know, I had heard that it will make a difference in cranking out parts. But I really had no idea until I did it myself. And what did you find? I could keep the machine running all the time. And how easy was it to learn and adapt to? It was really easy. It, it, it wasn't that hard at all. Yeah. I heard that you guys uh, threw this thing on the floor and ran it for 146 hours right after it hit the floor with no issue. That's right. And within 2019 till now, has Yamazin been of good support to you if there's ever been any questions with programming or machining or understanding any aspect of the machine? Oh, they're here all the time. I, I know the service tech's name. No, what is his name? Jason. Good dude, isn't he? Any, anytime we have a problem, Jason's right here helping us out. Well, Matt, I know that this was unexpected. I know that you really didn't want to do it, but also thank you so much for doing it, guys. This is the authenticity of what we do on camera. This is the importance of conveying these messages that are non-agenda driven and letting people like Matt convey that message truly unexpectedly. And I like to say thank you for being my next victim, but guys, Keep staying tuned to MTD North America. We have some great footage for you, Matt. You are awesome, my friend. Thank you.